Hey, Brian from Garage Mall. Today I have a, uh, a soldering kit because one of my grandson's toys, actually a wire broke on it. I don't know if you can see that, but, and I need to solder it. And I got this soldering kit. Um, awesome, straight from Amazon, right to, right to me. So even on vacation you can get stuff like from Amazon, it's awesome. So. Um, so this kit has everything that I basically need to accomplish what I need to get done. So let's go through the kit. So it has a bunch of different tips that comes with that. Um, it has a, I, I like the fact that it has this carrying case. So once I'm done fixing this, I can bring this back with me in a simple case. So that works out pretty good. So that's like your soldering holder. And there's your soldering iron. And I love the fact that it has a generously long cord that I can work I can work with I'll put that down there and then it has this stand so it looks like it kind of goes right through there so that will hold the soldering iron pretty pretty stable I guess that's slightly out of frame let me just put this over there for now so I'm going to put that there and it has this little sponge that you, you wet a little bit. And that comes up to, to form rather quickly. I'll dry my hands really well. So I've got some water tips in case, but that's awesome. Cleans up really easy. So it comes with some solder. comes with a set of tweezers, so that's helpful if you got to get into like a really tight spot to hold on to a wire. And I like how each one of these things has its own little separate spot. That is a wire cutter. Uh, again, it will work in a pinch, especially if you're away somewhere and you need to get something fixed right away. And then that is like your, uh, that's your solder, kind of like pull solder out of the connection if you have some excess solder. So that's pretty neat. So we'll put this all back. The only thing I'm going to need is basically, I think that basic, there is a finer tip. So before I plug this in, let's, uh, let's unscrew this. I guess that comes off. And then we'll take this big bulky tip. I'm going to exchange that for one of the smaller ones in here. This one more of a precision tip of what we need to get done. So we can change tips out really quick. And then just take that down. Yeah, we'll put that in there. Yeah, we're almost ready. I'm gonna put this old other tip away. And we're gonna close this kit up and get it out of frame just so we can just work with the solder and what we're fixing. Okay, let's, let's plug this in. Right, turn that on. So I like how it's got a dial there so you can adjust your temperature in centigrade. So we'll just turn it down. You can see how that turns on. So we'll start with like 350. We'll see how that goes. I'll bring this into play. And then let's open up this little, little bit of solder. little toy the wire broke off. I'm gonna pull it out and get that little 
classic wheel. I think we'll remove that out of the way too. You can see how it's got that little switch there. And we just got a little bit of wire, but I think it's just going to need a little drop of solder. So we are going to kind of put a little hook on that wire so we can put it through the hole and solder that a lot easier. That's what we're fixing. We're going to put that underneath the wing and have this wire hang over on the side a little bit. Okay, let's see how the soldering piece works. We're just going to put that through the cap. And we'll get the hole as we need it. So I'm going to position this. I think we should be warm enough. This up, put a drop of solder. Okay, so quick drop of solder, and then you can tell that that connection is done. So I'm going to put this back together again and show you how, how it works. And we are good to go. All right, uh, stay tuned. Okay, now we got everything back together. And it's working as it should, so uh, yeah. Now we got this toy fixed thanks to this awesome soldering kit. Anyhow, uh, Brian from Garage Mahal, thanks for watching and uh, be safe out there.